welcome today we will discuss spanish language basic concept in this video so first we understand what terms we will learn today first is i i means yo in english we speak i in spanish we say yo you we told to like hindi he is called el c eja de ejas ejos and we nosotros so again i yo you to he el c ella de ellos we nosotros go one by one for example if we ask who you are so i will speak yo soy ansul singhal yo means i so i means m ansul is my name so in english i will say i am ansul singhal in spanish we will speak yo soy ansul singhal again speaking yo soy ansul singhal and if somebody ask who is in this picture then we will say el is ansul el el means he as is they start with e but pronunciation is all together same like each we will say l h ansul means h ansul so again to repeat who you are so i will say i am ansul singhal or yo soy ansul singhal and if somebody ask who is he then we will say l h ansul l h ansul next like we take picture of katrina and if we somebody ask who she is then we'll say ella ella is katrina in previous the difference is l is ansul and then in this next slide ella so word is changed slightly l means e ella means c so there is the only difference l and ella and if she ask that who i am then i will say tu eres katrina so here r is used as eres so again who is she we will speak like normal in previous ella is katrina and if it is james then we will speak l is ansul so the slight difference is l and ella and that will be same and if somebody ask who i am then we will say tu eres katrina or tu eres ansul and if we talk about the third person then we will say l is ansul so there is three things first if somebody ask who i am then we say tu eres ansul tu eres katrina second if we say who each or she then we say each ansul alige uh, or alige ansul alige katrina and if somebody ask who you are then we'll say yo soy ansul so rich basic difference and then we move to the in plural format so no satro is used for v so like in this photo if we ask what for to speak so we say we are family or in spanish we will say nosotros somos family 
So somos you for R, nosotros you for V, and family is family. Uh, word may be changed, but I use the same word as same. Again, they. They will say adios. So if you say who they are in the picture, we will say adios, son, friend. Was it they are friend or adios, son, friend? What do we say? Adios, son, friend. So there is a confusion by the previous three slide about the SOMO, SON, RH, so Y and all are used for R. So I try to distinguish uh, these terms which are used for R. If used with V, then we will say SOMOS. If used with V, so we can go to the previous slide. So V, SOMOS, family. Can we use SOMOS for R? If they use with they, then we use SON. And if we use or U, so then we use RS. So R is used with the different uh, meaning or different word is used with different pronouncement. Again, if we use with V, we say SOMOS. If you use they, we use son, and if you use with then, uh, you then it is. So again, summarize all the PPT. Who you are, your soy, unsold single. Who is he, L is unsold. Then if it's C, then we say Ella's, Ella is Katrina. And if she asks who I am, then we say to arrest Katrina. If we speak about the V, then we use we are family. And uh, if we say about some person, then we say allos, son, friend. And again, summarizing, are you Jews in three method? If we use with B, then we say SOMOS. If we use with D, and so on. If we use with V, U, then we say RS. Thank you. Hope you get some benefit out of this slide.